guys in this video i will show you how you can fix con close pal world on steam it's quite easy and straightforward so without further ado let's get started so if you're getting if you just turn off uh, your game and you're getting uh, here not play but playing and you, you cannot stop it uh, maybe your computer freezes there is a, an easy fix to that so uh, the first thing what you need to do here, you need to make sure that your uh, GPU is fully updated. So depending on what you're using, I'm using G4 uh, NVIDIA. So there is an app called GeForce Experience, maybe using EMD. Also, there is a separate app to that. Uh, you need to go to drivers and check for updates. And if there is a update for you on your GPU, you need to download it and install it and then restart your computer. And then you need to look if the problem persists or not. And still, if you're getting this error, then you need to go to Steam, Library, right-click on the Palworld, Properties, then Installed Files, Browse. And here you need to do a few things. Then you need to look for Palworld .exe file, right-click on it, uh, Properties, Compatibility, uh, run this program as administrator, and disable full screen optimizations. Apply the changes, go to Pal, Binaries, Win64, Look for uh, Palworld Win64 Shipping EXE. Uh, then you need to go to Properties, Compatibility. Also make these two things here, right? And after that, you need to look if you're not getting error on the game. So sometimes when you run the game, you should get uh, an error. Uh, as you can see here, uh, for me, the game uh, on my second screen, I see that is working. But if you're getting some sort of error that it cannot uh, run this game because shipping exe is not working properly you need to go back and, and basically go to installed files again and just remove on uh, full screen optimizations on a power exe file and then here as well uh, just disable uh, full screen uh, optimizations on these two files right and still, if the problem persists, then uh, what you need to do here is to open up your browser. Open up your browser. And then you just need to write runtime C++. Uh, C++ and probably it will be the first link by Microsoft.com. Uh, and then you need to scroll down. And here you will see a Visual C++. Uh, this one is for 64-bit ARM. Um, the computer this one for 32 bits and this for uh, one is for 64 bits uh your operating system but and if you don't know what to use you just need to go to uh, system information and on this window here it will be the answer your system type for me is 60 x64 so i need to download this uh, to my desktop let's say and then you should get uh, this uh, setup. You need to open up. I agree. Install. And as you can see here, it's installing. We need to wait for a couple of seconds. You can see here, it's quite easy. And after you install Visual, uh, Visual Microsoft Visual C++, uh, what you need to do here is to restart your computer, as you see, and your problem should be fixed. All right, so that's pretty much it. And if I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.